Oh, hi there, sir. I get carried away with music. I love that Snoop Dogg. Or is it Nate Dogg? I get them confused. A anyway, I'm Marvelous Marvin, professionally trained disc jockey, been a radio DJ for 30 years, and a mobile DJ for 30 years. One of the things you got to think about, and one of the things that's going to affect your business, is your price. People are going to call around to different DJs. They're going to get a wide variety of prices. I personally found that it's a good idea to price yourself right in the middle of what other people price. Some DJs, if you're starting out, you can go do a couple things for free just to learn to trade. And the basic thought is that you charge about 100 to 100 quarter per hour. That's a basic average DJ rate. So you can spend anywhere from 500 to a thousand DJ, a thousand dollars or more on a DJ. Now here's something I do. I don't charge by the hour. Charge by the hour, that's eh, okay. But the thing is, I charge a flat fee. And I charge a flat fee for a reason. Most people, when they hire a DJ, they've already rented a room. Well, they've only got the room till a certain amount of time. And when the time's done, they're done. So if you charge a flat fee, they get a perceived value. But you don't want to overcharge. You don't want to undercharge. You want to try to keep it in the middle. Call around different DJs yourself. Find out what they charge in your market and go accordingly. I'm Marvelous Marvin talking about pricing. I'm a mobile DJ, and you can be one too.